morning to all today we are going to discuss about 10th class lesson india relief really features in this lesson we'll discuss about uh, geological background of india look at the board geological background of india you already learnt in 9th class about uh, continental drift theory who proposed that continental drift theory what was the theory continental drift theory proposed by look at the board continental drift theory proposed by alfred wessener he was from germany according this theory 220 million years ago single super continent one and only which is known as pangea which was surrounded by let's see it surrounded by pantalasa ocean understand next according to this theory 200 million years ago this single super continent which was separated by tethys sea so tethys sea separated by the two land masses one is angara land another one is gondwana land in north side north part known as angara land south part is known as gondwana land. Angara land is also known as Eurasian Eurasian land or Eurasian plate. Now let us discuss about how was Himalaya sub form. Indian Peninsular Plateau. You can see that Indian Peninsular Plateau is. Also in the part of Gondwana land. So, Indian Peninsula Plateau is a ancient land mass in the world. Two hundred million years ago, Gondwana land split into pieces. Split into pieces at the time, in course of time. Our Indian Peninsular Plateau move towards to the towards to the northeast direction like this, and collided with large Eurasian plate. In course of time, in this immense compression force. Folded mountains are evolved. How it is evolved? Let us see that example. How the folded mountains are evolved? 200 million years ago, our peninsula plateau moved towards to the northeast direction and collided with large Eurasian plate. At the same time. immense compression force and folded mountains have evolved through a folding process what is that folding process see look at this this is this is this is yes in this way folded mountains are evolved now it's known as himalayas Himalaya sub form present form of Himalaya sub form through a folding process. Understand? Now we we'll discuss about northern plains. How was northern plains sub form? Breaking of the northern corners of the Indian Peninsular Plateau. Large shallow basin was formed. 
large shallow basin was formed this large shallow basin was slowly got filled with sediments brought by the rivers what are the rivers one is from himalayan rivers from the north side himalayan rivers and south side peninsular plateau peninsular rivers so these are brought some sediments at that large basin was slowly got filled with these sediments brought by the rivers in this process our present form of northern plains were formed okay so this is also known as this northern plains are also known as uh, indo gangetic plain we'll discuss after that thank you